Hey everybody, uh, welcome to another episode of S Sexy Time. Uh, I think this is episode 7 now. Uh, here I'm just doing a run on uh, Nighttime Assassins, which is one of the runs from the uh, Mount Fuji pack, which not everyone has unfortunately. But I thought I'd just uh, do it to highlight what the runs are like. Um, as you can see, it's pretty similar to the Africa runs, which I think is probably the most hated in the whole game. Um, I mean, if you like those Africa levels, please tell me, because um, I just find them horrendous. I mean, they have the two main problems with trying to do trick mode on this game roll into one. Uh, one of those is that the holes, uh, where you can just fall down at any moment. If you look to left and right, there's, there's a hole right below me there, so that would have killed me instantly. There's a hill that just did kill me. Um, the other problem is the uh, fact it's all enclosed. So if you if you do go off a ramp uh, high enough, you'll just slam into the roof and lose your combo. So that's never fun. I would have liked to have gone up the top right route there, but never mind. <laughs> because I think this might have been my first go on this though, actually. But it's just worth it to see a good score. I got the top score in my uh, friends list anyway for doing this run. But yeah, it's just a case of sort of tricking as often as you possibly can. So there's not many ramps. Tricking off the wall is always a good thing. Mind that huge hole on the left there. Uh, stick to rails if you're going to go off the edge. Um, it's much better than just falling down the hole. Uh, fortunately, you get to sort of open air area every now and again. Um, so try and use the open areas to the best extent you can. This bit's pretty horrendous because it's like, there's a real tight thing. This is what I was talking about with the rails. Uh, use the rails to sneak across large holes. There's another one here. Yeah, next up, whole section. Uh, 99 Assassins is, is a run from the top of the mountain. Um, it, it meets another run about halfway down, so I imagine we're probably into that run now. And it's a duplicate trick, so I was really slacking the day I did this. <laughs> it's not so fun. I like this section here. But yeah, you can you can sort of tell that this was the add-on content because it really doesn't have the sort of level of graphical polish and stuff that some of the other levels have. I mean, you could argue the same about um, Africa, really, considering it's just in the dark, in a hole. Uh, <laughs> I think the idea was just to let you see as little as they possibly could, so they uh, could just make the graphics whatever they fancied it to be. <laughs> but oh well. I, just, I would certainly stick to uh, the Rockies and things like that, and the Alps and stuff, but they, it's interesting just to see what it's like. You notice the, the routes are very nondescript, just empty white. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, this is not an interesting. It's really just a case of just doing as many flips as you can. See, regardless of whether there's a jump or not, keep your combo up. I use a little tail press every now and again just to keep the combo still going. Mind that hole there, and that's basically the entire run. So uh, not much to see here. That's a good 14 million or so. Uh, easy peasy. Uh, if you got this run, just go for it. Just finish it off. I would. It's not really worth going back to. Uh, the next run in episode eight is uh, much nicer. We'll see you soon for that one. So um, thanks for watching everybody. Back for uh, episode 8 very soon. Bye everyone!